Welcome back to Grey Wolf TV. We are moving on to episode 4 of season 5 of The X-Files. That last episode as to how the long gunman came about and how they met Mulder and what set them down the whole path of the government conspiracy route was very interesting, very well done and filled a large gap that we didn't even know we had. I, I, I thought it was really, really well put together. So, let's carry on. This is episode 4. Hold it still, Sloan. I'd like to see. What are they measuring? The sooner they pave over the swamp, the better. You should be sad to see the demise of an ecosystem that's lasted a thousand years. We all should be. What's he got to discover? Wait a minute. What? There's a dead body buried out here somewhere. Weird. How? Oh, bugger! Ah, it's ah, like a. a where did he go? I don't, I don't precisely know what the hell he was. Really sorry for a second. That was a pair of eyes. Whatever it is, it, it, he just went. <laughs> Your eyes are gonna run. See ya. Oh, dog knows. Dogs always know. I want you to take bow, and I want you to run straight home. What's the matter? I yeah. want you to run straight don't do it. and I don't want you to stop for anything. Features, but with a face and eyes. Oh, oh, shit. We were doing an exercise called Team Builders, where we were given two minutes to build a tower out of ordinary office furniture. We could never have done it alone. Kill me now. Yeah, I was just thinking that. you ever been to that. one of these team seminars, Agent Scully? How hard Stop it talking. Was not to use the word but. I'm having that same problem right now. <laughs> Why these two with them? Sorry, folks, it'll be a few minutes. What's going on, officer? Got a little situation, is all. Thank you, Jesus. Where's he going? Investigate. My husband, Michael, he, he was teaching our son to shoot. And he said the dog got spooked and, and then he heard gunshots. And, and now they said they've found a jacket okay. with blood on it, but they won't tell me anything okay. about my husband. I'll try to find out who's in charge, all right? FBI, who called you guys out? And nobody, we just got stopped at your roadblock. It sounds like you had a shooting. And this morning, a boy got separated from his father. Separated by what? It looks maybe like some kind of animal attack. Moved into the brush, there was a third set of tracks leading away. I. I couldn't identify. Couldn't identify as the surveyors? As man or animal. Really? You have panther in these woods? There's panther, bear. But these tracks look like neither of those. No. No, sir. You want me to tell them that you're not going to make it to this year's teamwork summit? Yes. yes. You see that? We don't need that conference. We have communication like that, unspoken. You know what That'd I'm thinking? Me. What animal will attack the strongest, leaving the weakest to escape? The answer is none. And what does that have to do with anything? It makes me think that what we're dealing with here is no ordinary predator. That's nature. Mulder, we're in western Florida. Yeah. The closest thing to primitive down here is living in a beachfront retirement condo. I'll be back soon, and we can build a tower of furniture. Okay? <laughs> it's not... Is he outside? Is he... Is he is he track the kid home? Uh, I'm not sure you should have done that. I swear to God, if you said. I was gonna say, I see a pair of red eyes that before you came up. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh no. Don't tell me it's gonna take long. Invisible men don't have glowing red eyes. When she came back, the door was locked from the inside. And? Look at this. We've got some tracks here. Oh. Where? Here and here. Dried mud against the top, tracked in from the outside. I mean, people walk heel to toe. Whatever this thing is, it walks on the ball of its foot. I mean, distribution is strange. They appear to be human, but whoever left these uses the balls of his feet more like an animal. It's just, well, it's too smart it is, for his own good. It's attacked three grown men, presumably in broad daylight. Well, uh, it's called a FLIR for forward looking infrared. He's developed for chopper pilots in Vietnam. Detects body heat at 300 yards. 
Once we start in, you can put away your cell phones. The only communication in these woods is with shortwave radios. So stay close, maintain visual contact. If you get lost, initiate oral contact. They were amused when I told them what we were doing. I bet it's a drifter, Scully, and we may be looking for two individuals. If your enemy is greater in numbers than you, you divide and conquer to diminish those numbers. What enemy would that be? Tree people. Approaching development. What do you think killed those men? Nature is populated by creatures either trying to kill something they need to survive or trying to avoid being killed by something that needs them to survive. Correct. Especially in the woods. We have got something. Maybe. It's about 20 yards ahead. Well, I don't see it. Don't separate. There. there it goes. It's on the move. No, don't split up. They're moving in opposite directions. He said there was two. There and there. About 40 yards ahead of you. What is it? I don't know. This thing, whatever it is, it seems to be taking them in specific areas because... As you can see, the ground that they're walking on is pretty solid. It doesn't look like there's been any rain recently or anything, um, at least not for a day or so. So the, the, the ground seems to be relatively solid, but it's pulling them through the damn ground very quickly. Uh, so may, maybe, maybe all underground there's like a network of tunnels that it uses and there's certain area weak points where it's dug through possibly and it waits for him to get to any one of those locations that's how it's able to pull them straight through within a matter of seconds just blink an eye in the goal that was on purpose they divided us so they could go after her she was yes. in the lead and presumably the strongest they take the strongest first She's your you take them where that doesn't make any sense you can't just disappear out here that's not gonna work out here we need to get out of here this is nuts. This is Looney Tune, man. We gotta go back out of these woods before it gets dark. We have to find her. Yeah, but if we stay here, they may not find any of us. No. We have no way of telling them where we are. We don't have any food. Michelle had her only water. No, it's a bad Look, I'd idea. like to find her too, but I think the risks of that are just way too foolish. Killing livestock, terrorizing the people. Witnesses describe them as primitive looking men with red piercing eyes. It became known as the Mothman. I got an X file dating back to 1952 on it. I got it. Where? Uh, I got it on the screen. Right? About one. 30 yards ahead, it's just sitting there. Oh, sneaky bastard. I mean, the other thing here is as we grow up into adults in particular, we are trained and socially, uh, socially trained to filter out anything that isn't real which is why a lot of people come across things that you know are strange or x-file type that you shouldn't see in your brain convinces you that it's not there so the fact that this thing shouldn't exist and we don't know what it is and adding on the fact that it can camouflage itself you could stare directly at it unless it opens its eyes because obviously that's the dead giveaway it is a primary color and you could look directly at it in your brain, and your eyes tell your brain that it isn't there. Kelly, I lost it. I got it. Did you well, hit it? You both got on your ear one clip each. It just stopped. Where's Glazer? Oh, he's running. Oh, you fool. See ya. There you go. <laughs> Knew that was going. Don't fire again unless you're sure you're going to hit it. Maybe trying to spend our advantage. What? Hold on. Oh my god! Oh, why? It didn't drag him under. It was dragging him across. I was told once that the best way to regenerate body heat is to crawl naked into a sleeping bag with somebody else who's already naked. <laughs> Shit. Mothman. <laughs> really? Yeah. But there seem to be only two of them. If you get tired, you wake me. I'm not gonna get tired. Jeremiah was a bullfrog. <laughs> <laughs> 
was a good friend of mine. But I helped him drink his wine. I don't know that song, but that was funny. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm looking for food. I found some wild berries. I wouldn't go far. Mulder, you never left my sight. Tell that. Tully. Tully. Great. It's got Tully. it. Tully! It's got it. I bet me I'd find the only right. hole. Yeah. Who's down there? Probably the rest of your victims. I don't know. Yes, she is. Not for much longer. Mulder, we have to get her out of here. I'm not alone. Now you know. <laughs> I think she's got it. I think she got it. Explain that. Too bad we don't have any office furniture. See us now. Go team. Agent Mulder! Oh, thank We're God for that. Here. We're down here! <sighs> what are you doing down there? Oh, I thought I'd have a pie. We've got injured people down here. We need a ladder. Right away. I'm trying to work out what the hell it was doing. So the skeleton we saw down there would have been somebody who was just never found in town. We just got all the thanks when you did all the work. Mm. On the contrary, Agent Kinsley, we would have never gotten involved in this if not for you. Really? Yeah, you see this? Oh yeah, I pointed that out to Agent Stone Cipher on the drive down. The Spanish conquistadors used to carve it on the post that they would lash the natives to as a warning. So who are you saying wrote this? Ponce de Leon came here 450 years ago looking for the Fountain of Youth. Search and rescue are Good still talk. unable to find Jeff Glazer or the second predator that you reported. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if they couldn't find either one of them. These predators have been in these woods for a long, long time. They would have perceived any encroachment on their territory as an Correct. enemy, even a little kid like that. Oh, she got a lift back to the motel to pack up both your things. She did? Excuse me. Of course, you took one from it. Scully! Scully! Muller, what's going on? Let's get out of here. Okay. Pack everything? Come on. That was. <laughs> that was good. That was good. <clears throat> okay, episode four. What a really, really good episode. There are some of these that are uh, some some of the weaker episodes, but there's not many of those. But a lot of them are completely independent standalone episodes that stand the test of time there was absolutely nothing wrong with that it was weird it was creepy it was unexplained and all of it made sense except for the fact that we don't know precisely what the hell that thing was and whether it has been here for hundreds of years and like anything as we know evolution and nature does over and over and has done for millions of years on this planet things adapt to their environment and maybe it has just become precisely that but i can't believe those two are the ones that ended up having to rescue him <laughs> it was actually a good job they were with them on this so-called conference in the first place but that was a really really enjoyable episode anything in the woods where you're being hunted or terrorized is scary Go, go out into into the middle of a massively wooded area at night. Don't tell me that fight or flight instinct that's in all of us somewhere doesn't kick in at some point. Especially if you hear a noise and you know you're supposed to be alone. 
it, it's no different than like a dark, scary night with a thunderstorm going outside and the wind blowing and the windows rattling, and then you hear a thud, you know, like, the floor is up. <laughs> I'm sorry, you just do. It's in all of us. And that episode epitome that it was great right um i will be back with episode five next if you want to watch this in full length patrons your place to go all you need to do is check the link in the description if you enjoyed the video guys by all means please give it a thumbs up if you haven't subbed already i am on the road to try and get to fifty thousand subscribers this year and i would dearly love to hit my target and you are the guys who can help me do that so i would appreciate a quick sub if you haven't and i will see you for episode five next take care Oh, 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 oh,